Well, composers have always used technology in music, whether it was Beethoven using the latest version of the piano at the time, which was louder and bigger and more powerful, uh, or co uh, contemporary musicians using computers to help them calculate things or um, make new sounds. We've always been interested in technology. Humans have been sort of mirroring themselves, aspects of themselves through art across the ages. I guess an innate need to answer the question, who am I? Monterey Mirror is a computer system that allows a performer or composer to play to the computer. The computer will listen as the person plays and then it will continuously generate a response that will sound similar to what the user played. So essentially a performer can play something and the computer can play back something so the performer and computer can essentially you know, jam together and play back and forth rather than just sitting alone and trying to figure out something without any feedback. So if you can, you can add a trigger in here. Okay, so you want to ha be able to trigger however many mirrors are playing. Right. Okay. This is, of, this is a mirror of sorts, a mirror of sorts, uh, in that it mirrors your, your musical world, your musical space. It's not the mirror of your face, it's a mirror of your music. What Monterey Mirror does isn't, you know, doesn't seem like something that a computer should be capable of doing and having it actually perform and uh, be able to show it to people and have them say, wow, that's incredible, that's, uh, that's really exciting to feel that you were part of making that happen. There are computer musicians that, that know computers and there are computer scientists that know a little bit of music, but there's very few people on this earth that can do both at a very high level. And I think this is a very powerful collaboration that you combine the best of the best and it's, it's completely open-ended. Thank you.